Today we're tackling a paper that's basically legendary, at least in the world of natural language processing. NLP, for those in the know. Right. Attention is all you need. It's not just a catchy title. Definitely not. OCaml, a general purpose functional programming language that is also an imperative language and also an object oriented language. It is what Haskell wishes it could be. Hey everyone, my name is Muhtasham and I'm excited to talk about the world's first open source video editing agent. Backstory is that we needed some automatic tool to edit videos for reskill.io, a platform for personalized learning. While doing so, we quickly realized limitations of FFmpeg and started looking for more intuitive and flexible alternatives. Remotion was nice, but it had unreliable server-side rendering. After trying out Core, we really liked the API as it did not require the separate rendering backend. We met with the author of the library and decided to collaborate and build this agent together. The Core library from Diffusion Studio can do complex compositions via JavaScript TypeScript based programmatic interface, meaning we can use LLM to generate code to run this. And if we take a step further and let our LLM write its own action in code, it's a perfect match, simply because code is the best possible way to express actions performed by a computer. Lastly, multiple research papers have shown that having LLM tool calling in code is much better than in JSON. Now, let's take a look at current architecture. Agent starts a browser session using Playwright and connects to operator UI. This web app is video editing UI designed specifically for AI agents. It renders video directly in browser using Web Codex API. It also has helper functions for transferring files from Python to browser and back via Chromium DevTool protocol. This is a typical flow of agent. We have three main tools, video editing tool, doc search tool, and visual feedback tool. First, a video editing tool generates code based on user prompt and runs it in browser. If additional context is needed, Doc Search tool uses RAG to pull the relevant information. After each execution step, a composition, the compositions are sampled currently at one frame per second, and they are, they are fed to Visual Feedback tool. Visual Feedback tool can be sold as a generator and discriminator, like in famous gun architecture. After the visual feedback tool gives green light, the agent proceeds to render the composition. We also shipped LLMs.txt, which is essentially robots.txt but for agents. You can see sample in the screen. LLMs.txt, in addition with specific template prompts, will take you far in your video editing journey. While while you can bring your own browser and run the agent, the current setup is also flexible enough to let the agent connect to a remote browser session via WebSocket. And each agent can get the separate browser session, which is GPU accelerated. And of course, there is a load balancer, load balancer behind this. Of course, the first version of the agent is in Python, but TypeScript implementation is underway. As the fam famous saying goes, any applications that can be written in TypeScript will be written in TypeScript. Thank you very much. This was collaboration between Diffusion Studio and Reskill. 